What's going on, Fortnite man? It is your boy, Phone Boy, coming back at you guys with another video. As you guys can tell by the title, I'm going back to my roots. I haven't done one of these videos in a minute, man, so I'm gonna go ahead and bring it to you guys today. A lot of you guys have been asking for these videos in the comment section, so I'm gonna go ahead and bring you guys in weekly sneaker rotation. So let's get into it, man. Let's get. All right, so before we do get into the video, though, I have to make a few small announcements. Well, one of them is pretty big, in my opinion, and a lot of you guys wanted this. So before we get into that, though, shout out to the uh, subscriber who made me this shirt. This is not my merchandise right here, but he went ahead and sent it to me so I could just wear it for the videos. And it looks cool. He sent me the design on DM, so I thought it looked cool. So he sent it to me. So yeah, if you guys want to go ahead and go follow him on Instagram, it'll be on the screen right here. So yeah, anyways, if you guys want to go check out his Instagram and website, go ahead. That'll be on the screen, as you guys already saw. But anyways, moving on to the second announcement is a pretty big one in my opinion. I just went to the post office earlier this morning and we got a P.O. box for you guys. So the P.O. box, if you guys want to send anything, will be in the description down below. So yeah, the address to it will be in the description down below. You guys can send whenever you want. You guys can send whatever you guys want except for your money because I don't need your money, okay? You guys keep your money. But if you guys want to send anything to your boy, fan mail, letters, fan art, shirts, your designs, anything you guys want. Go ahead and send it to me, man. The address to my PO box will be in the description down below, like I said. Moving on to the last and final announcement before we get into the video, let's get it. Man, a lot of you guys have been asking me to start a gaming channel, which I already did, but I hadn't posted videos yet because I still need to buy the Elgato. So yeah, if you guys want to subscribe to somebody who takes their YouTube gaming serious, make sure you guys go subscribe to my stepdad. His link will be in the description down below. So yeah, make sure you guys go subscribe to him. He does a lot of gaming 2K. He's like the number one glass cleaner in the world, I believe. I don't I don't know I could be wrong but you guys go check out his channel to go find out so yeah that'll be in the description down below with all that being said let's get straight into the video man let's get it all right so moving on to Monday what I wore for Monday which is also Martin Luther King Day shout out to Martin Luther King but what I wore on Monday was the royal ones in my opinion these are one of my favorite shoes in my collection but this shoe on feet looks super long this shoe just looks so long on my feet I don't know why like I'm, I'm like five I would say I'm five eight almost five nine and this is a size nine and a half and this just looks like it's a size 11 on my feet. So I don't like Jordan 1's for that specific reason. Other than that, I love the ones, to be honest. But yeah, this is one of my favorite shoes in my collection. I wore this on Monday. As you guys know, Martin Luther King Day, you don't have school. So even though I didn't go to school when I went out, I wore this shoe. I didn't go out that much, though. But yeah, this is what I wore on Monday, Martin Luther King Day, the Jordan 1. Royals. Man. So yeah, that's that shoe. Moving on to the next shoe. All right, man, moving on to what I wore on Tuesday. It was the... Columbia 11 lows and this is one of my favorite shoes in my collection as well just because 11s are one of my favorite Jordans This baby blue is my favorite blue and blue is my favorite color if that makes sense So yeah, as you guys can tell super clean shoe in my opinion the mesh yellows a lot That's the only thing I don't like about this shoe But other than that this shoe is super cold in my opinion one of my favorite shoes in my collection This is what I wore on Tuesday man. Just a color shoe. I mean you can't go wrong with these so, yeah. All right, man. So, this is what I wore on Tuesday. Let's get into what I wore on Wednesday. Let's get it. All right, man. Moving on to what I wore on Wednesday. It actually matches this shirt a little bit. Black, red, and white. It is the Jim Red 12s. Now, if you guys watched my sneaker collection video with my boys in it, I did say I wanted to sell this shoe just because it was, like, growing off of me a little bit. But I wore it again, and, you know, I just can't let these go, man, honestly. If somebody wants to trade me the flu game for this, if you have size 9.5 flu games, I would trade these. So, yeah, man, if I'm not going to trade these for some flu games, I'm going to just keep them because I, I like these too much, to be honest. But I do like the flu games a little bit more, actually a, a lot more. But, yeah, this is what I wore on Wednesday. I just can't let the shoe go, man. Look at how cold that thing looks. It just looks super cold, especially on camera. This thing looks crispy. But anyway, this is what I wore on Wednesday. Moving on to what I wore on Thursday. Let's get it. And I do need to clean these shoes too. So make sure you guys stay tuned for that video. I'm going to be cleaning every shoe that I need to clean, which is almost every shoe in my collection. But anyway, moving on to what I wore on Thursday. It's going to have to be the UNC Jordan 6s. And this is one of my favorite shoes in my collection. I know I say that a lot. I'm like cash nasty in a sense. But uh, yeah, I say almost every shoe in my collection is one of my favorites just because I like all of them. I'm not going to buy a shoe if I don't like it. You feel me? So. This is what I wore on Thursday, super cold shoe in my opinion. I wore these with my American Eagle like ripped jeans with the acetone. I also wore the black polo with this too. So I know I didn't say what I wore with the other shoes. I don't know why I didn't say it, but yeah, that's what I wore with this shoe and that's what I wore on Thursday, which was the UNC Jordan 6s, man. So moving on to what I wore on Friday, man, let's get it. All right, so Friday was kind of a day that I was like, forget, I'm gonna just throw something on. These shoes I usually wear when I'm feeling that way. So, you know, these are a beater to me, even though they're super clean still. What I wore on Friday, Friday was the Motorsport 4s. As you guys can tell on camera and in person, they look super cold, super white, and super crisp, man. No creases, 
no dirt stains anywhere but you know i just i take care of my shoes even if they're beaters so i wear this whenever i just want to throw something on whenever i'm just going to go to the store when i'm wearing sweatpants anything like that i'm going to throw this shoe on just because i don't really care for this shoe that much but obviously i kind of do because i keep them clean but anyway yeah this is my beater this is what i wore on friday clean shoe in my opinion i'm not gonna lie i do love the colorway black white and blue jordan 4 jordan 4 is one of my favorite jordans of all time other than the 11s and 12s and threes so yeah just having this kind of colorway on one of my favorite jordans you know it's nice to have but everybody wears them everybody has them so i just kept them as my beater yeah this is what i wore on friday moving on to what i'm wearing today let's get it all right man so i don't know if i'm doing anything today but if i go to the mall with my friends or if i go anywhere at all i will be wearing the jordan 13 oh oh I will be wearing the Jordan 13 bread today as well as this shirt. You know, I'm going to rock this shirt for my boy who made it. It goes together, so I was just like, why not? So, yeah, this is what I will be wearing today, which is Saturday. So, yeah, the Jordan 13 birds right here. Super clean shoe, in my opinion. I love these 13s because usually 13s look extra bulky and fat on your feet. But the material that they put on this shoe is super soft. So, it just like when you tie it or like whatever, it molds to your feet. So, it doesn't look bulky like the other 13s. You feel me? So, this is what I'm going to wear today. So this will be the last show I'm going to be showing you guys in this video just because it is a weekly sneaker rotation. I'm uploading the video today. So obviously I can't show you guys what she'll wear tomorrow. But hopefully you guys did enjoy the video. Like I said, if you guys want to send me anything, any fan mail, fan art, letters, anything like that. If you guys want to shout out your YouTube channel and a letter, do anything like that. Make sure you guys go ahead and send your stuff, anything, okay? Anything except your money. Send it to my P.O. box. That will be in the description down below. And also, I keep letting you guys know this, but Vision 5 and me will be going to SneakerCon Bay Area. Bay Area SneakerCon is March 31st through April 1st, so you guys will be seeing us there. As well as my merchandise, which is not this, but I will be having some merchandise. The store is already up. I just need to do some more business stuff in the background of the store. And whenever that's done, I'll go ahead and get it out to you guys after I show it on the video and show that the quality is nice. I'll send you guys straight to the store. So yeah, make sure if you guys enjoyed the video, leave a like, comment some more video ideas that you guys want to see in the future, comment notification gang, and subscribe to join the foreigners and also hit that bell too so notify whenever I post a video. All right, man, but before I get on out of here, I'm going to go ahead and shout out the post notification shout out for today's video. If you guys want to be shouted out in the next video, make sure you guys comment under this video. Post notifications turned on in all capitals and just comment something positive under that whether you guys love the video, whether you guys subscribe, or you guys can comment what videos you guys want to see in the future, anything like that. But make sure you guys put post notifications turned on in all capitals over your comment, okay? So I, I'll be able to screenshot it and see Ralph that who turned on post notifications. So if you guys want to be shout out in the next video, make sure you guys do that. But anyways, moving on to today's post notification shout out goes to Joshua Miller. He said, hashtag notification gang. Okay, there you go. He said, I love your channel and I'm inspired to do YouTube more now since I found your channel. Thank you, appreciate that. We are the same age and I thought that starting YouTube at 15 is a young, but you're almost at 100K, so keep grinding and making videos fire videos by the way so shout out to joshua miller if any of you guys are inspired by me to start a youtube channel that means i'm doing my job if you guys are inspired by me to do anything good in life that will benefit you or people around you that means i'm doing my job so i appreciate each and every one of you guys that comment some positive stuff and leave a like on every video and share the channel and share the videos man i appreciate each and every one of you guys i love y'all each and every one of you guys so anyway enough with that sentimental stuff i'm gonna get on out of here it's been your boy phone boy hopefully you guys enjoyed the video let me know if you guys want to see another one of these next week and i'll go ahead and bring it out for you guys make sure you stay tuned for more videos in the future i got fire videos coming and it's been your boy phone boy hey 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 and i'm out let's get it